Hi, Hiram here. The other day when I did my uh, How I Use Weber Lighter Cubes revis Revisited Again, uh, I got a couple of questions. Samuel Tyree 1 said, Is there a sell-by or expiration date on the Weber Cubes in the company package? No. There's nothing on the box saying about when it expires or when to use it by or anything like that. Nothing that I can see. Now there is some numbers here on the top right here, but I got no clue what that is. It's just their batch numbers probably. Uh, I was just at Home Depot today and they still carry these. It looks like they're around three dollars. This is a pack that I got last the end of last summer. Unfortunately, sorry about the glare, it comes in a package of individual drawers and then it's just sealed on top with a single piece of aluminum and unfortunately you can't just cut it and make these separate things the the uh, aluminum foil just comes off so nothing that I can see on this now I have some cubes of this at the end of the summer last year I took them out of that package and just put them into a plastic bag like this but that made them like you know what almost two years old and these still burn even so now that I put them in the plastic bag so I hope that helps nothing that I can see as far as a date also medic Jim R asked he was he said he was given two wet fires to try and heard that they have a short shelf life Again on this, there's nothing on here that says a use by date or anything like that. These are some that I've had <clears throat> since what? January, about January 1st of 2010. This was a packet that I bought from Cheaper Than Dirt. And I was saving them to put in special things, what was left over from this. So now this is, that makes that what like... <clears throat> two years plus that these are how old these are so I'm going to try one today now when I weighed these back in 2010 they weighed five grams each on my other heavy scale I've done it again on the lighter one and they read 4.9 4.8 grams I don't know if that's just a difference in scales or if they have dried out some but I would have thought that these things would last almost indefinitely because they're all sealed up in the plastic, little plastic pouches. And I figured that was why they cost so much. So, you open them up. And here you have a cube that looks like half of one of the other cubes, one of the Weber cubes. It does feel a little oily put it on my wet fire stove now I'm going to do a repeat of a test I did January 3rd 2010 with one Weber cube on the wet fire or one wet fire tinder cube on the wet fire st titanium stove the Boy Scout pot with one cup of water in it one cup of water setting at 61 degrees now let me write that down. 61 degrees before it was uh, 57. Room temperature is 67 degrees. When I did this before in January of 2010, room temperature was 48. All right, I'm going to light this. There goes the cube. Put that on there. That's one cup of water at 61 degrees. Now on the previous test, when I did it with the new cubes, one cup of water came to a boil in 5 minutes and 42 seconds. Let's see what it does this time. Already it's setting up. That's one of the reasons why I like these for fire starters, but not for cooking on. So anyway, let's let this go and see how long this takes. There we have 
to 10 to 11. Come on. To 12 at 448 it looked like. Okay, and let's let this go until run out. Okay, we're going, going, gone. Let's say at 8.07. Okay. Let me just dump this out. So, this was one cup of water starting at 61 degrees. Room temperature is 67 degrees compared to 57 degrees for one cup of water and 48 degrees from the room temperature when I did this back in 2010. And uh, so time to boil today was 4 minutes 48 seconds. Time to boil back in 2010 was 5 minutes 42. So that's almost a minute shorter. Hmm. I wonder if that's because of room temperature plus the water was a couple of degrees warmer three degrees warmer four degrees warmer but I don't know kind of looks to me like the cubes in these the uh, wet fire tinders rather don't seem to have a short shelf life these are cubes these are tinders I'm sorry that are what two years and what three months old and they still burn still boil the water in just about the same time and still set up the pans terribly now I do only carry this stuff the other ones that I have in my uh, survival kits and whatnot for starting a wood fire I definitely don't use this stuff for heating water great little stove I've used it with other things, uh, Weber cubes for one, uh, hand sanitizer in here, all kinds of old videos with this. Nice little titanium stove. The one thing I do do is I put a piece of aluminum on the cup of the stove so that it's a little bit easier to clean out. So in answer to Medic Jim R's question, I don't think this has a short lifespan. I don't see why it would being sealed up in a plastic package, which like I said before, I think that's why they're so much more expensive than Weber cubes. I'll put links down below to old videos that I've done on the wet fire stove and the wet fire tinder, so you can give a look at those if you haven't already seen them. I thank Samuel Tyree 1 for his comment and Medic Jim R for his. I thank you for watching. I look forward to your input, questions, remarks, helpful suggestions, and as always, watch for my buddy Max. Bye now. No, you've been a good friend. And that's in the